Bishop g5 is what I wanted, but the point is he goes bishop d6 check, king e8, and then rook c5. If I take, he takes and he hits the pawn d5. d4, queen e6 takes, king f1, bishop e3, king e2 with b4. I think white's better with the pawns and then the bishop cutting off the king. So that's why I didn't like bishop g5. So he's going to play f4, I assume, and then I'm probably going to play g5 here to try and smash the structure. He can't take on f6 because there's a check, and then I win the rook on c1, of course. So, um, so f4, g5, g3 or something. <laughs> Not bad at all. Uh, that was so need a W, as you said. Although, shout out to Santiago, playing quickly. Oh my gosh, oh, Hikaru is going to swindle Bruzon. Uh, oh, and, and uh, okay, and he, we just saw uh, him off camera. He smiles. We got we to gotta bring him up. Oh, wow. Wow. What a, what a hustle there. Oh my God. I feel like I've been here before. I wonder if it's a me problem. I keep creating these night forks. No, that's not so much a problem. Partners work in one move. Oh my God! And then, you see that? I did see that. Oh I, my I, God! I, and then the guy, talk about blunder dome. We are gonna oh, have double the fun guy. in this game. That is a that is a long double rook. That's what he clip. gets for celebrating too early, right, Danny? Oh my gosh! That was crazy. Okay, we got to stick right here and see how this finishes. We might have more blunders. In fact, it looks like Black is gonna win now. Holy bejesus! To blunder your rook. Five and knight h five, knight of five. So now he's definitely if he gets g5 knight e5, he's better. Um if g5 knight g5 takes queen g5, king h8, knight h5, then black has bishop e8, hitting the knight and covering the g7 squared, so there's no checkmate anymore. So um so g5 was playable, but knight e7 seems more pragmatic to play rook e8, put pressure on the e-file first. Um I assume Fabiano is going to go like queen h6 or h4 maybe to stop g5. He might even just go queen d2 because then keep the same g5, e5 idea. He plays queen h6. But then again, whenever I play CMs, I know I got to beat them because these guys are so bad that they decided to get a CM title. Like, you know, you got to know that you're so bad that you can't even become FM that you just, you're just like, all right, I'm settling for this garbage. CM's the worst. But then again, that's probably what GMs think of the FM title. <laughs> that FMs are the worst. Okay, thanks for the fork. You're able. He is letting me improve my pieces with tempo here. King Crusher sucks. He is the worst, and his his fans are even worse than him. King Crusher probably has the most toxic chess fans out of anyone in the chess community. I mean. He's probably one of the reasons why I almost didn't start up chess streaming. No! No! No, no, no. Ah! Accurate pawn moves are the hardest for me to grasp. Any tips? Well, it sounds like you're really good at finding the shitty pawn moves. So just count all the pawn moves that you consider playing. They're all gonna be shit because you can't find the good ones. And then all the other pawn moves that you didn't think about, those are the good ones. And look at this now. Um, there is a school of thought that says the French defense eh, is too difficult for black. Uh, Black's giving up too much space. And in the winner, where the, the variation we have on the board, he's giving up the dark square bishop. Yep. And Bobby Fisher just poo pooed the uh, French defense, said it was terrible. Play, play a6. Whoa, Amanda plays chess. Thanks for the bits. That's a new name. Appreciate it. Let's play, play this move. Okay, time is, is going very well. If only, um, I mean, I've been averaging two seconds a move. Anyway, um, it it's happened a lot in Newark. Uh, it's happened it's happened on the coast actually in LA a bit too. Um, I mean, I do fly in and out of LA more often than I would like. So um, it's like in LA, you're in the minority, not being a celebrity. Yeah. Okay. So we're gonna watch this game between Fabiano Marijuana and Daniel Nero. Or sorry, Fabiano Caruana. Stupid chat. You put that stupid name in my head. 
between Fabio. Somebody, somebody screenshot that? Anybody? Somebody? <clears throat> Still theory. Go, Rosen. You know a small, a little bit of French because you lived in Belgium. Well, I did live in Belgium, but also I took French in high school for four years and I lived in Belgium. So it was a, you know, it was a, a dual kind of citizenship. I've got a threat. I've got a threat. Oh, he's going to do it. What?